So uh, what we have here is a patient who uh, has uh, injured her ankle and we're putting her in a fracture boot uh, to uh, rest the area. Uh, the problem with the fracture boots, and they are great devices, they've, uh, they've helped us quite a bit with uh, decreasing the amount of casting that we had to do. Uh, prior to this, we had to put patients in a cast. It was messy, uh, time-consuming, and difficult for the patient. They couldn't take it off until uh, you took, removed it for them. And with these, where patients can remove them, they can shower, they can do some range of motion exercises. They're great devices. The problem with the fracture boots uh, has been that in order to allow a patient to walk more normally in these, uh, we have to have a fairly thick sole that is rock or bottom to allow a normal range of motion uh, at the knee and hip. Unfortunately, that thick sole creates a limb length discrepancy. That limb length discrepancy that you can easily see if we line up the feet here, uh, the sole of the shoe is much, uh, is about an inch generally uh, deeper than, the, than on the other side, even in an athletic type shoe. And that created a limb length discrepancy that causes hip, knee, and back pain for a lot of patients. And so what we used to do in my practice was we would have the patients go to the shoe store and have a sole glued onto the bottom of the shoe. Uh, worked very well. And the problem with that was very expensive. Uh, it basically ruined the shoe. Patients weren't going to pay to have that sole removed once they were done with their therapy with their fracture boot. And finally, they also could only wear that one shoe unless they paid to have another shoe um, uh, accommodated for the boot. And so what we came up with was a simple device called an Even Up. Even Up is uh, basically uh, three sizes and uh, two height adjustments. It also is, uh, works either on the right or left shoe. So uh, what you'll see here is there's a midsole here that has pegs in it and comes out easily so that if you only need to add about a centimeter of height, uh, you take that layer out. If you need the full uh, two centimeters, which is typical and average, uh, you would wear the entire uh, both soles. It stretches on over the shoe very easily, tip of the shoe, toe, and then around the back like that. Then there's a strap that goes across the front of the foot to aid in uh, cinching the device down and keeping it in place. Uh, there's only uh, one thing I've seen anyone do wrong with applying the even up, and that is they apply it through this thin portion of loop here, and really what it needs to do is go around the thicker portion of this uh, and then across, and then this doesn't it keeps prevents that from breaking. So but very simple to put on. Um, makes it much more comfortable to walk. Patients walk now more, much more level, and their hip and knee back pain that they were complaining of is totally alleviated.